かった病んでた僕にさえ優しくしてくれたそんなに夢中にさせないで繋がっていくたびに君の沼に溺れる毎日なんか全部許せるしやっと分かったよ愛の意味を、yeah、その手つないで笑い合っておでこ合わせてよなでなで頭に手を当て笑ってる詐欺と Can you hear me now? Okay. Okay, for some reason it disconnected my mic. Like, my mic was on, but it wasn't connected to the thing. Like, um... So it says, like, device... Device, and then it names my microphone? Yeah. Also, yes, um, as I was saying, um, but you guys couldn't hear me, the fourth viewer, usually, if there's, like, just one that's not talking in chat, it's my, it's my alt account. So. <laughs> it's something that all streamers do. But, yes, it's my, it's my alt account. Or in this case, my other VTuber, my other, um, YouTube, because I have two for my, I have one for model, uh, showcases, and then I have my main live channel. So just a, a silly little explanation. It was my own account when I was streaming. I'd be watching my own stream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've done it. I've done it the entire time. Ever since day one. Because it's just something that streamers do. Unless you're, like, big and you get, like, 10k people of you or whatever. <laughs> 
Hold on, let me clean my glasses and then I will switch screens to boot up the game. Ew. Be like, yo, Lucas, I have two viewers, and he's like, bestie, that's you and me. <laughs> I mean, you gotta get what you can get. Hi, Southern. Oh, man, I have to update my, my room. My VTuber room. Hold on. Let me um mark that down really quick. There we go. When I stream Little Nightmares to Lucas, he had someone show up that started role playing, and I was like, "Bestie, please." <laughs> now we need Ami and Suki. Yeah, Suki's probably asleep though. I don't know. I don't ever know where Suki is. Suki is an, enig an enigma. When is Suki not asleep? <laughs> He's playing Baldur's Gate. Oh, yeah, yeah. We're not going to see him for a while then. Do -do. Oh, is it not going to? Wish I slept, JK. I do sleep not like often. <laughs> I actually slept pretty well. Is it not going to do the thing? Bitch. I'm playing all day. I miss him. I can still hear his voice. <laughs> oh, wait, no. There's, there's character profiles. Okay, there we go. Oh, oh, this is chugging on my PC. I never considered the idea that my PC would not be able to handle this game. Hold on. Let it chug. Let it chug. Let it chug. Do your chugging. Can you guys still hear me? Yeah, um, it's because my PC does not like this game, apparently. I never once considered that my PC would be too weak for this game. Can I turn down the... I don't know if that did anything. Okay, it's not chugging as much anymore. But it's still chugging. That's wild. Are 
Are you kidding me? That is so insane. This game is so big that my PC could not handle it. Did I try one more time? No, I was gonna plan it out. We were gonna stream this. Ugh. So sad. Should I try one more time? Don't make your PC explode. I mean, it was getting up there. Maybe if I downloaded this off stream, it would be okay. We could try, but be careful. Yeah, my PC is calmed back down. Let's try. Oh boy. Maybe we just have to deal with the lag until. Until it downloads. Encoding overloaded. Better turn down video settings. Video bitrate? Do I turn down the bitrate? Let's go down to low quality for a minute. Let's just deal with the lag. I think I turned down video settings. I have turned down video settings, buddy. You all talk someone talk amongst yourselves for a little bit. Hopefully it'll get better. We're moving normal again! Now, how much of a shit did this take on my stream's quality? It's not chugging anymore! Is it too loud? It's 
my way. Hello. Welcome to the Detroit Experience. I'm an android and I'll be your hostess. Before we begin, let's make some adjustments to optimize your experience. <laughs> I have to leave touching the bathroom, but I'll leave my earbuds so I can still hear. Okay. Let me see how much of a dump this has taken on my quality. What quality do you guys normally watch at? I'm just curious. Isn't me? Doesn't look much different. I don't, truthfully, I have no clue what an encoder does. But let's just put this back up to the standard settings that I already had on here. It was like 2500, two, two, right? And then let's put it back up to... To better quality. 480? Ooh. I feel like that's I feel like that's all right quality. What do you guys think? Should I I don't know how to make my streams higher quality. Is that something that always bugs me? Hi Suki, hello hello. This game is so realistic. Yeah. I like 720. Yeah, 720 is usually pretty good. 720 is usually what I watch at. It it looks pretty fucking good at 720. I'm 480 right now, though. Yeah, 480 looks okay. But it's a little fuzzy. I don't know. I wish... I, I think I'll do some research into how to make it look better. Because when I, always whenever I watch back my streams, I'm like, it's so fuzzy. How does anyone watch my streams? <laughs> I'm gonna lose a staring contest. Yeah, this is my wife, by the way. Uh, oh, can I play with my controller? Let's see. Today in 720? Yeah. I can't use my controller! <laughs> I'm so happy. How dumb it was, 720. <laughs> Uh, so yes, obviously in English. We're not gonna watch J JP. Maybe if I do a replay, I'll play it in JP. Subtitles on. Alright, how do you guys want the subtitles? The subtitles are for you. Large subtitles. Medium subtitles. Or small subtitles. Large, okay. There you guys go, so you can see, you can read. So you're not illiterate. Please adjust your screen settings. Okay, wifey, whatever you say. <laughs> Brightness, just until the center icon is very, barely visible. The icon is already barely visible. Can you guys see it? Yeah, we aren't illiterate. Yay! That makes one of us. Thanks for subtitles? Of course! I always make sure my games have subtitles if I can. No. Can you guys see it now? Is it is it barely visible to you? I want to make it so chat can see too. Hmm. Are you doing good or evil run? Um, I'm doing a whatever I feel in my heart kind of run. Thank you. Now select your profile. Um, I want an immersive gameplay and advanced controls. A fair challenge where mistakes can mean losing a character. I want to focus on the story with simpler controls and more forgiving challenge with fewer chances to lose a character. Hmm. I'm a gamer. 
So logically, I should go with experience. What do you guys think? Because I would be down with either of them. I'm pretty good at QTEs. So, casual. Okay, let's see some more consensus. What are we feeling here? Casual? Okay, okay. You guys are like, we're already making my play Resident Evil. We don't need them to be stressed. Well, invested. <laughs> I only know this game only by memes. Oh, trust me. You'll see you'll see the classic memes, don't worry. I kind of want to do experience, but I'm also like, I already am playing Resident Evil. <laughs> hmm. Okay, first playthrough will be casual. And then if we do a second one, then we'll do experience. You can stare into those eyes all day. Yeah, so could I. Isn't she so pretty? Isn't her name like Chloe or something? You are now ready to begin Detroit. Remember, this is not just a story this is our future she is so pretty oh my god it's my boy is it too loud or does it sound okay sounds good okay you answered before i even asked <laughs> look at him flipping his coin he's just like me for real it's good? Okay. Negotiator on site. Repeat. Negotiator on site. <laughs> the fishy. Do the lucky lose. to learn how to do that like him? Yeah, I wanted to for a while, too. Can't get me in business when they tighten and straighten the tie? Yeah. <laughs> I love Connor so much. I love all of the characters. They did really good with all three of the main characters. Also, when playing this game, I think the only thing I got to was meeting Marcus, so... And I haven't, I haven't watched anyone play this game in a long time, so it's almost like I'm going in blind. I mean, I had a big hyperfixation on this game for a long, long time. <laughs> I like making him run around in circles. <laughs> Phillips John. 10, 11, 1999. Phillips Caroline. 2001. Phillips Emma. 2028. I've never played. 2038 is only 40 years away. 14 years away? Yikes, yeah. You have you not finished it? No. Please, please, you gotta I just wanna girl. pick up my fish, lady. Wait. You're sending an android? Alright, ma'am. You, you need to go. You can't do that. You why aren't you sending a real person? Watch, watch me be human with the fish. Watch me be human with the fish. You'll believe in me after I be human with the fish. Wow, look, I can save your daughter. I saved the fishy. This is a very good game. I'll show all you bitches. You know what I don't give a shit about? You, buddy. That's a wall. I save it even, every time, even if I do more evil runs. Oh. 
This game is ADHD's worst nightmare. Which one of you is the fucking captain? You? Captain Allen. My name is Connor. <laughs> I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's firing at everything that moves. It already shot down two of my men. We could easily get it, but they're on the edge of the balcony. If it falls, she falls. Ooh, Southern. Possibly refresh a little bit. Um, what's his name? Do you know its name? <laughs> I don't have a clue. Does it matter? Yes. I need information to determine the best approach. Um, emotional shock. Has it experienced an emotional shock recently? Listen, saving that kid is all that matters. So either you deal with this fucking android now, or I'll take care of it. I'm trying to talk him down, bitch. What do you mean? Um, but Southern, possibly refresh a little bit, because I think you're still lagged from when the game was downloading. This is trippy to play on an Xbox compared to when I played on the PlayStation. <clears throat> Black Hawk, capacity 17 rounds. Could have done like a deactivation code? Yeah. I was trying to be nice though. Reconstruct. There's no refresh? Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, because you were a little bit behind, bud. Okay, is that all I needed to know? Think you might? Of course! Okay. Why are you all running ahead? I have to... I have to figure out what happened. Ah, uh, yes. Team music number 85. This is Daniel, the coolest android in the world. Say hi, Daniel. Hello. You're my bestie. We'll always be together. Bestie! I love Team Bop for music number 85. Oh wait, I said 84, didn't I? Sorry. Can I not, like, change the camera angle, please? Games like this are so difficult for me. That's for real besties? Yeah! I'm Daniel. <laughs> this girl is so cute. Yeah, she's adorable. Oh wait, I didn't understand why I had to look. I wasn't paying attention, Connor. Can you look back at it again, buddy? No, no! Okay, I guess I can. I'm gonna let you fucking change the camera angle. I, I understand why they don't just freely let you change the camera angle. But like, come on man. Can I not look at this again? 
Is there anything else to look at in here? I don't think so. Man, fuck it. I'll just look back at my own damn stream to figure out what the hell I missed. Okay, what was I looking at? A bathroom. That's what I was looking at. Okay, cool. Good to know. <laughs> Slightly better than Resident Evil? Yeah. Oh, it's so cheesy. I'm going to write a poem about Maya after this? Oh boy, I'm scared. <laughs> bathroom, I don't think there was anything in there though. Yeah. Hunter, can you turn around a little bit, buddy? I don't want to look at these guys' ugly mugs anymore. Is there anything else for me to find? What are you doing, bro? God, I do not envy the actors for this because they had to like move like in every little possibility. My Toriku has big, big ears. They're so big, they can hear your fears. Perfect. No, I'm not. need to have the news on your fucking TV. You're living it. something else to look at here, but I don't remember where it is, and I know what's important to look at. Oh, that was a cute way to walk. How come the robot can't touch the water? Because he's like, they're sophisticated. Only one shot. This piece. Eckerd and Tony. Bullet wounds. Very hard ventricle perforated internal bleeding. The legs make he did when he turned? Yeah, it was so cute. Um, Raven, isn't there supposed to be something about them moving or getting a different android? Do you know where that is, perchance? He's so cute. I know! He's adorable! I just missed the shooting. Oh, he was shot first, though. Wait, what? There should be something about them moving or getting a different android, and that's why he freaked out. But I don't remember where to find it. Or if I'm just hallucinating. <laughs> a magazine or something like that, but I can't remember where you find it. Yeah! Like the family talking about getting a new android? Yeah, that.
Don't move in, bitch! No, I don't want the gun. I don't want the gun. I don't want the gun. I do not want the gun. No! Detective mind? Yeah. Where's the damn... Was he looking at it? Is it this? I see you with the shiny bitch! Oh, can I not look at it yet? Deceased, Phillips John. Upper lung hemorrhage. You know, no, 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 no. I'm a detective today, not a doctor. Left kidney perforated. Middle abdom uh, ad abdominal trauma. Lower lung hemorrhage. Internal bleeding. Father was holding. Oh yeah, I can't look at it. Detective Mai, yeah, I'm so smart. Well, I don't need a new clue. I saw the clue right there. I've already unlocked it. Okay, you gotta read a magazine cover, but I don't know where it is either. It's this one. I'm not gonna take the gun. Wait, that's who we do for real. I was doing research? No, don't worry. He's so cute when he turns around. Look at him. Look at him spinning. What the fuck are you doing? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I love his little spin, Jimmy, too. Don't come any closer or I'll jump! No, no, please, I'm begging you! Do a flip! Go, go, go! Man, is already hanging off. Hi, Daniel! Now, my name is Connor! How do you know my name? I'm the android in my cyber life. I know you. I've come to get you out of this. Can you bitches stay away and let me do my job? I know you're angry, Daniel. But you need to trust me and let me help you. I don't want your help. Nobody can help me. All I want is for all this to stop. I, I just want all this to stop. Ooh. You're defective, Daniel. No. There's a problem with your no, software. No. We're going to fix you, and everything will be okay. I don't need to be fixed. I'm working perfectly. But my eyes are open now. Can I talk to them again? I will never let anyone humiliate me again. Ever. I know you and Emma were very close. You think she betrayed you, but she's done nothing wrong. She lied to me! A baby. I thought she loved me. But I was wrong. She's just like all the other humans. No, she's just a baby. Daniel, no. Listen. I know it's not your fault. These emotions you're feeling are just errors in your software. Oh, yeah, 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 no, yeah. It's not my fault. I never wanted this. I love them. 
you know? But I was nothing to them. Just a slave to be ordered around. I can't stand that noise anymore. And tell that helicopter to get out of here. Huh. They made it tricky. <laughs> That's like a special yeah. little surprise. <laughs> I did what you wanted. <laughs> trust. You have to trust me, Daniel. Let the hostage go, and I promise you, everything will be fine. I want everyone to leave. And I want a car. When I'm outside the city, I'll let her go. <laughs> I saved the baby, that's all that matters. I saved the child. <laughs> I scarred her for life, but at least she's alive. At least she has a life to be scarred for, you know? <laughs> I would rather be alive and see a dead android than be dead, okay? <laughs> Thank you, play the first chapter. I would've compromised? Uh, okay, but I'm bad with impulsive choices. Hunter died protecting Emma. Oh, there's so much I could have done. What was the secret option? Okay, wait, I have to put the warning because that is very valid and true because even that part makes me uncomfortable. Like, that part makes even me uncomfortable. I'm actually just going to pin your message about it, Raven. Okay, my head pass for you. Thank you. I have food. I want to take a bite really quick. Wait, which part? The whole thing with Kara and stuff. The later sequence with them. It makes me uncomfortable. Okay, she go away. You already had your dinner. Hold on. It's like um it's like a chicken salad on some lettuce. So they're like little lettuce boats of um of chicken salad. Yeah. Thank you, Raven. Let me just go ahead and pin that real quick. I appreciate it. I should 
Should I do this for Resident Evil, or do people, like, pretty much assume, like, do they know? Do they know? <laughs> it's a zombie game about zombies. It'll gross people out. <laughs> Yippee, I'm so professional. Yeah! Yoshi, if you do not get away from my food, I'm gonna lose my mind. World stats tab. 14% of people got the one that I got. Oh no. 95% of people did the friendly approach. Yikes. I think people know, and if they don't, they must have lived under a rock. <laughs> Am I allowed to go back and redo that, or should do I have to stick with what I have? I regret doing it now. Am I likes to live dangerously? No. <laughs> this is the top of the range household assistant. Hello, child. Let me zoom my eyeballs in on you. Let's go. And handles the kids in elementary school. Good afternoon. Exactly what we need. Very basic model. How much did you say it costs? At the moment, we're doing a special promotion on this entire range at seven thousand nine hundred and ninety dollars. Not bad. With a forty-eight months interest-free credit, and it, it does absolutely all the work around the house. Oh, Painting, hello, handsome. Plumbing, gardening, repairs. At night, it's <laughs> an excellent choice. <laughs> if you'll just follow me, we'll process the order. How much is it? Baby kitties are talking. Oh. Go away, go away, go away. There I don't want to go home with you. You're so gross and icky. It's difficult getting it back in working order. Okay. It was really messed up. What'd you say happened to it again? <clears throat> the car hit it. Stupid accident. Ah, I see. Anyway, it's as good as new now, except that we had to reset it. Meaning My we kittens had to wipe have been raised on your streams. I hope good. you don't mind. It'll be fine. Okay. Did you give it a name? My daughter did. AX400. Register your name. Kara. Looks so gross. My name is Don't Kara. Punch him in the nose. I imagine his actor is probably a really pleasant person in real life. But his character, I want to punch in the nose. I fucking hate that bitch. My phone vibrated so loudly. Nasty Williams. This game is so pretty. You know who voices Hank? Yeah, it's the guy that did Mr. Krabs' voice from Spongebob. Should have had SpongeBob voice Connor. <laughs> Fancy Brown? Yeah. Yeah, Kara, you're not gonna go live in those awesome places. You're gonna come live over here with the unkempt yard. Would have died laughing if they did that. <laughs> what is it with the games not exactly made for children having voice actors who voice children cartoons? <laughs> Music is so beautiful and comforting. Yeah, the music in this game is really nice. This game has a lot of good topics. Yeah, there's a lot of important topics to discuss. It's my man. Oh my god, it's my man. Everyone, look at him. He's so handsome. 
Would you like to go home now? Yes, Rose. Yes, I think that's enough. Here. Let me help you. Oh, oh thank you, dear. Narrator Kirsch George is voiced by Frank and Shameless. <laughs> Page one. Secrets of Android. How cyber life designs androids to coexist with humans. Designing androids that are easily accepted by humans was a huge challenge cyber life had to overcome. Jason Graff, director of humanization department at cyber life, unveiled some of his design secrets in our recent interview. The first androids were perfect. They had perfect faces, perfect expression, and we soon realized that there was something disturbing about them that made people feel uncomfortable. CyberLife worked on ways to humanize its machines so that way they could enter our homes and become new members of our family. Strongly is voiced by a guy who voiced Hawkmoth. Yeah! Oh, I love, I love, I love him so much. Although I guess Genshin isn't non-kid friendly. Oh no, the actual game. Pretty dark. Okay, guys, here is the burning question every every YouTuber who plays this game has asked. Would you own an android, and how would you treat it? Fun fact, Clancy Brown played an awesome zombie villain in Pet Cemetery 2. Ooh! This dark book on Apple is rated 12+. plus. Yeah. But you know what else is rated? Young like that, fucking Love in Deep Space. If you've ever played Love in Deep Space, that shit's not made for 12 year olds. I would and I would treat it as my husband or boyfriend. Us. <laughs> I would treat it with love and respect like one of my family. I'd own an android to be my bestie, not clean my room, but to be my bestie. We'd go on picnics. Honestly, I would ask it to clean my room, but I would also treat it humanely. Like, I wouldn't purposefully clean, like, destroy my room to, to make them do it. But if I'm having, like, a hard time with pain and stuff, I'd be like, hey, can you help, can you help, a, a, a can you help someone out? <laughs> can you help me out, please? <laughs> I'm in pain. <laughs> Mine would be more like an accessibility and like a slave, you know? Oh my god. <laughs> Fenty, you'll see in the future that that is a discussion on some of these, um... Some of these little magazines. That is something that happens in this game. <laughs> I'd pay them to clean my room as they did. Yeah. Yeah. Or I'd at least, like, give them stuff, you know? I'd be like, you can't eat, but do you want me to cook for you? <laughs> Basically, my point that I'm getting at is that I'd be nice to mine. <laughs> I was a little behind. No, yeah, don't worry, don't worry. I created androids of both genders and all ethnicities. Analyzing. I don't like how that sounds, but. It isn't my favorite thing, so I'd ask it to clean for me. Yeah. They created androids of both genders and all ethnicities. Thousands of voices to find the most pleasing tones. Realistic blinking was perfected, though totally unnecessary, along with breathing, facial hair, and many other humanizing traits. This perfect simulation of humanity, down to the details that androids simply don't need, is the secret to, of CyberLife's design success. I prefer not to have an android. That is so valid, too. I'm gonna have an android to just be my roommate. <laughs> A very expensive roommate. Those guys cost a lot. Climate change up. How the environment is changing America's society. <clears throat> a recent U.S. census has found that as sea levels continue to rise and climate change leads to more and more extreme weather, America's once prosperous coastal cities are being deserted by the rich. Waterside real estate and once... Top attractions like Miami and Los Angeles are experiencing fright flight. Resident wealthy residents opting for offered for properties further inland or at higher altitude. This is driving up prices in once rural areas and plummeting house values in previously desirable neighborhoods. Whilst this 
It might sound like an opportunity for poorer Americans to enjoy a new lifestyle, but the reality is less attractive. <clears throat> Coastal properties are not just exposed to regular flooding hurricanes and other climate Sorry, cough. Other climatic weather. They're also suffering from urban flight with all the services and amenities blowing richer customers into new areas. Urban development specialist Arnold Waters called this the donut effect, whereby the previous centers of coastal cities get hollowed out. This census is just the latest example of how climate change is affecting American societies in ways previously not imagined altering not only the face of our environment, but even the social fabric of our nation. Cool. No more lonely nights for me if I had an android. It always feels nice to be with it. <laughs> you can't go off the path. You could say please, bitch. Water, please. People would hear me being polite to my android and they'd be like, what the fuck? Did you just say please to a robot? And they'd be like, yeah. You know who I'm not gonna say please to? You. <laughs> Are you guys holding hands? Can you hold my hand too? Damn, just like real life. Let's say, was I supposed to go watch for something or? Oh, the game doesn't let you get run over and waiting for the green light? Yeah. <coughs> or at least, like, haha, -ha, dying sounds water. Thank you. Yeah. Can I have a hot dog? Hey, move it. You're scaring away my customers. What if I want to be your customer, huh, bitch? What I thought. <laughs> Off topic, 12 miles? Yeah, for real. Five more to go. Yeah, 17 miles in all. Fuck you, give me a hot dog. Yeah, for real. Okay. I guess I've seen all I needed to see. Like, I cut in front of me. Get, jump over and get the hot dogs in. Get her a hot dog. Yeah. Can you get out of my way? Yeah, because there's assholes God, like you going around. It was supposed to serve man, but it is becoming our new master. Why do you look at me so, demon? Oh. I know who you are. Um, yeah, hi, my name's Mike. I can see through you. Oh. You are the one by whom the evil will come. A VTuber? You are the one who will destroy Detroit. A VTuber? Yeah, probably. Androids are Sorry, Detroit evil. VTubers are taking over. Man seeks to imitate God by creating life. Did you grow? Kind of life is this? Ah, a life 
Despite being an English speaker, I cannot for some reason understand what that man is singing. My brain won't comprehend it. Yeah, no, my brain's not paying attention either. Don't tell me I'm scaring away your asshole customers. I'm gonna buy my android ass a hot dog and look at it. <laughs> Wearable media player. You know what those are called? Headphones. What's up, bro? You're cute. I'm going strong there. <laughs> Select package. What's up, bro? Identification verified. You kid too. Here is your order number eight four seven. That will be sixty three ninety nine. Please confirm payment. Your eyes are so pretty. Payment confirmed. Oh. Transaction complete. This man, fun fact, is the closest I've ever had to a Hollywood crush. He is just so dreamy. Him and Tom Holland are probably payment with a wink. <laughs> Him and Tom Holland are probably the only two, like, people I've been like, oh. Can I go down this way? Let's stop. Use RB to switch- <gasps> It'll be ten dollars, wink wink. <laughs> No, honestly, if I was an android, I would probably, like, accidentally blink with both eyes. Like, we read that... We read that thing about how... This lady looks like she's using this thing for the first fucking time. But the thing was like, oh, we got our androids to blink, blink realistically. Meanwhile, I'd be over here like... Hold on. What's my toggle button? I'd be over here like... <laughs> I'd be like, something's wrong with that one. <laughs> that, that android needs a little bit of help. <laughs> That's the kind of android I'd be. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that one's programming. Why is it blinking like that? <laughs> oh my god, that's so cocky. That's cute. In front of your boring ass coffee shop. Where the fuck you going, Tin Can? Hmm? I'm sorry, motherfucker, but I am not made out of tin. Hey guys, check it out. We got one of those tin cans here. I am made out of a bunch of complicated shit. Look at this little motherfucker. You steal our jobs, but you can't even. You wanna up? go take care of an old man? I don't think so, bitch. I would be like, it looks like these commands will actually cry if no commands are given. <laughs> Like I said, do you guys want to go take care of an old man? We're gonna fuck your bitch ass up. Yeah, waste it. Do it! Alright. That's enough. Leave it alone. Let us teach this bastard. Imagine beefing with something that doesn't even feel emotion. Damage it, I'm gonna have to find you. I totally get why they're upset, but it's not the android's fault. Like, fuck you. See how you like it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but, like, they're thinking talking on. about, like, I don't know. I would be happy if Andreas took our jobs. Are our jobs. Like, yeah. that brings up so much free time for humans to have. Yeah. Like, we can't, people can't do anything that they like. They can't find new hobbies or anything anymore because, like, they're always stuck working at grocery stores and shit. 
Like, people can't follow their passions because they have to pay bills. Just eliminate the bills and let the androids do the work. Like, I don't see the issue. The game is about how, how I feel about AR art, but those people are feeding other people art into computers. Yeah. Yeah, except for AI can't ever take our jobs because they can't even draw hands properly. Uh huh. <laughs> AI art isn't art because it can't be created organically and, and there's no thought into it. So eventually all art will, all AI art will be absolute because if everyone used AI art, then the only thing that's feeding each other is AI art. So everything will be used and made if that's the only kind of thing we have. In their situation, they have free time, but they don't have money to live. That's the thing. The bills aren't eliminated. We see later. Yeah, I'm talking about like more like um uh, like our situation. Sorry, sorry, Marcus, making you stand here. Um, but like in real life, my my situation means more like real life because people are talking about how this can happen to us one day. So I'm like, we don't really need to fear. Like in real life, we don't need to fear technology like this. Because we can just have more free time if we have technology like this. If the governments handle it properly, then we're okay. Hello, my hello. But also, another thing with these guys. This guy was getting mad at Marcus for taking his job, okay? No one wants to do elder care for their work. That's one of the... Uh, yes, I know. I know. I'm talking right now. That's one of the issues. It's because... Androids do mundane work. Hello? Why is my controller dying again? That was weird. Androids do mundane work, so I don't understand why these people are pissed off. Because these people, whenever they had the jobs, didn't want to do it anyway. We are from the IRS and we'll show you delinquent on your taxes. Blink once for no and blink, get, get arrested and blink twice for payment and we'll leave you alone. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I thought you meant in the game because people in the game do have a good reason to be upset. Like, as a broad statement, they have a good reason to be upset if they're going nuts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, I meant like... And I should have clarified, so that is... That is my bad, but yeah. In real life, I don't think androids would be a problem. I think if humans, if the governments and officials handled the rise in androids, I miss one thing, stare at the hot dog vendor. Oh, would he have accosted me if I <laughs> stood there for too long? But I feel like if governments and everything handled it properly and eliminated bills, then people could have more hobbies and more free time to live instead of just working 24-7. I personally believe rent and shit should be eliminated anyway, but whatever. <laughs> I was gonna say, well, let's not get political, but that's kind of hard not to do when you're playing this game. <laughs> I, as a person, believe that bills should be done away with and people should be able to live life. And not all Coming? androids have bullshit jobs, but a lot of those people in the crowd have, like, labor jobs? Yeah. You've been gone for two weeks, so the place is a mess. You do the housework, like, the washing, the meals. Like, no problem. Go meals, sell androids, you, you know? Of... Like, go get hired at one of those things. God damn it. Where the Parking fuck is the rat gone <laughs> Alice! Alice! This part makes me uncomfortable. Oh, there you are. That's Alice. You look after her. Homework, bath, all that crap. Got it? Yes, Todd. Get started down here, then you do upstairs. Hello, my child. I'd rather have a person at a grocery store than a robot because self check uh, is a headache and service is so slow. See, I'm the kind of person that likes self checkout <laughs> because the people TV are too off. slow. <laughs> yeah. Maybe. 
Oh, it is need. so pretty. It's broken. Yeah, yeah. See, I'd like. I can get that. I'd rather a block. Yeah, yeah. Oh, because oh, hopefully they would go as fast, go fast as soon as your parent leaves. Yeah, <laughs> Please rescan your item. You at the register? The hell, I didn't scan it. <laughs> oh shit. I was like, check out, but the other day I accidentally scanned a thing twice. Deleted the second one, and it was like, you were breaking the law, someone will come to help you, and it took five minutes. Yeah, but th think about how quick that would have been if they would have had androids at the cell service. <laughs> Kara! Yes, Todd? Bring me a cold beer! Especially when it's sort of like so smart like these ones. And that have a bit of humanity, so they would be able to see that that was an accident. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here! I'll get back to work. You're the one who had the TV on. Hello, hello, welcome! How are you feeling today? I'm feeling great. How are you feeling? I need to back. I want to detain you on the spot. <laughs> It was a sim clip once, and I scanned the can of porn twice by accident, and you could remove it off the whole amount. You have to call it and play over. That looks like they're about to do it. Alice, She's so you cute. better stop Leave that. Her alone, Todd, you bitch. Right now. Why Can you not give me a second into the whole can of chili? <laughs> you are under arrest. <laughs> I'll push you, bitch. Strangle you for making them walk to the register to fix it for you? Yeah, see if there was an android, you wouldn't get any dirty look. <laughs> I'm very pro-android if you can't tell. But also give the android rights, you know? Sad and stressful because of yesterday? Oh no! Everything goes okay, though. Where's his laundry? Oh, yeah, it's inside. Can I talk to her? Can we play a game? You look bored. Would you like to play a game? You like playing out here? <clears throat> no, they gained sentience and throw the damn chili up my head like this. He was an accident. I'm sorry you hate your job. <laughs> but so nice of you. <laughs> Wait, let's see how she turns around. Does she do a little twirl too? Ooh. Oh no, she pivots. She pivots on her foot. Logically, androids would never work in the world because we saw how people were when self checkouts were first introduced. Oh, I thought their thing was blue, not red. You 
you shouldn't mess around with my stuff. Hey, bitch. It makes me nervous. Maybe don't put it in the I'm fucking sorry. laundry soap, you dumbass. You just stay the fuck out of my business. Unless you want to piss me off. How'd they pack it like that? You want to piss me off? No, Todd. I'll flick you on the fucking nose. I'm the only child who never got affection from my parents because they worked a lot. If I had an android, I would be so happy. Yeah, or the android could do their job and they could be home with you. <laughs> Wait. <clears throat> Doesn't. Uh, no, she can headbutt the railing on the stairs over and over until you move her right, apparently. Wait, really? I love the way she stands. She's so fucking cute. Oh, I can't go back outside. Oh, drugs are bad kids. Yeah. Are you Venti? Yeah. But also, sorry, Venti. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have responded like that. <laughs> what does the board say? Nothing. I can't read it. Oh, they've got like poem thing. A frantic vision of you. Of. Something you said, Norm. What? He means love. <laughs> Power. That one didn't do a very good poem. Hmm. No, no, it's good. Okay. You're walking with her and she kept smacking her face on the pillar. Be <laughs> the counter. The stream has 60 likes? Sheesh! Also, the guy with the- with the android that was helping him- Helping him work out, I would rather die. If I had someone watching me work out, I lose my mind. Like no, go go back home. You rest while I go run. Hmm. Interesting. Looks like Detroit's popular. Yeah, it really is. It still is, which is crazy. This game came out in 2018. I cut across too quick. Didn't like that. Forty-seven. What kind of bill is that? Gas bill? Oh, oh, that's a high gas bill. Negative account balance, bro. What are you spending it on? Maybe you shouldn't have an Android. Uh oh, debt problems. <laughs> the state of America. <laughs> And by run, I mean sit on the bench for an hour until my run is supposed to end. <laughs> I don't even know what that was. It was bill. There's like gas bills and I guess mortgage and other stuff like that. I had credit card. Um. Can I get on the bus? Oh! The laugh? The <laughs> That's how what I read it as. Bill's my favorite thing to look at. Nah, for real. Speaking of bills, I need to make money for my bills. Oh, man. She's car like shit, but if she wanted to, she could bench press him and rip it in two. Yeah, for real. The thing I'm going to do will either piss everyone off or make everyone cheer very loudly. I don't want to read sport. No, I think sports should stay a human thing, actually. 
Quartz were made for humans to have fun. I don't like the noises he's making. Everyone, if you're if you're listening without earbuds, turn it down. You could tie him in a little bow for real. I've made a good start down here. I'll head upstairs. Do what you have to do, but stop bothering me. Leave before he makes more noises! I don't want to get demonetized! Well, I'm not monetized at all, but I don't want to get, like, in trouble with YouTube. That's a pretty toy. It's me, actually. What's its name? Thanks, Kara. Shut the fuck up, Todd. Everyone put in your headphones. Have you played this game before, Mai? Um, I've played... I've played it until... The... The later on... Like, the night with Kara. I've played, like... A little bit of it. Go over him, la la la. <laughs> Just go la 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 over him. <laughs> I've played a little bit of it. Not anything, like, crazy. What? wait. Oh no, don't turn on the lights. He can't afford it. I like her. <laughs> but yeah, I've played a little bit of it and I've watched um, a playthrough on it. But that was like when it first came out. I know it's supposed to be like sentences. Yeah, that's why I'm like, put your headphones in. If you're listening around people, be careful. <laughs> I'll try for <laughs> drive up the electricity now? Yeah, electricity is expensive, man. American football has largely resisted the spread of Android players, with top tier games still an exclusively human affair. But that may be about to change. Following CyberLife's recent unveiling of technical demo QB1000, an Android quarterback capable of throwing from end zone to end zone and hitting a target six inches wide, the model is also programmed with over 1,500 plays from classics such as bootleg bootlegs and handoffs. Are those sports terms? To more specialized maneuvers, all of which can be adapted in real time. QB1000 was revealed at a recent CyberLife exhibition in Detroit, where the Android manufacturer showed a variety of prototypes designed to show the potential of bleeding-edge technology. But while CyberLife's latest innovation has some fans drooling, Roy Kinstone, founder of Anti-Android Fan Group, <laughs> is a sinister aspect. CyberLife know exactly what they are doing with this demonstration. They hope to distort our sport the same way they have all the others. Despite these reservations, some consider this simply a matter of time, with a basketball and baseball already contemplating Android players. An LED sport QB... An LED supporting QB might be just around the corner. Hmm. I'll start moving all his shit around. Like, just move the couch slightly to the left so he smacks his toe in it every time he goes in the living room. Yeah. <laughs> Coach Pete, I'm going to teach you football. <laughs> I feel like, okay, I feel like for the, like, the football and stuff, and, like, the art aspect, and, like, Edred's having human uh, jobs, like, taking over those kinds of jobs instead of just, like, mundane jobs. I feel like you could have two leagues. Like, why does it have to be one versus the other? Why can't you just have two leagues? This is like, um... This is like people being, like... Thinking the field of something is too competitive. Like, no, the crowd just sees two cakes. <laughs> you could just have two things to enjoy. So I feel like while you shouldn't ban them from the sport, you should, like, have a separate league for the sport, you know? Just like there's men's basketball and women's basketball. You wouldn't put a woman on the men's team. Hmm. Merka, hell yeah, yeah. I think Android sports can be, like, cool, like, once a year, just see how much their abilities have changed. The fun little bit, but mixing superhuman and human strength together, see who wins isn't fair. Yeah, I mean, like, separate, though. 
I don't mean, like, have them compete at the same events. Or be on the same teams. I mean, that would be interesting for a one-year thing, but for normal, I feel like it would be okay to have, like, their own thing. Like, how I explained men's and women's basketball. There's a men's league and there's a women's league. Or whatever the fuck basketball teams are called. Oh, I got you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, I feel like I feel like both could coexist. It's just people don't think of these things. Yeah, I don't know sports, so you're talking to the wrong one. I was typing before you started explaining. <laughs> the price of life, how driverless cars make life a death decision. Space tourism is Mars your next holiday destination. No, Mars cannot be colonized. Um, yeah, I'm gonna drop that truth nugget and not explain any of it at all. When a driverless vehicle foresees an accident, the car's computer makes life and death decisions. For example, deciding which of two which of two pedestrians to hit. But the exact process by which cars make these decisions is not very well understood. Martin Forlong of Crown Cars tries to clarify. In these situations, the car's imag imaging system gathers data to determine the pedestrian's age, gender, life expectancy, etc. in the blink of an eye. This data is parsed through the public record to determine marital status, employment record, life expectancy, and whether the they have children. The car then assigns a value to each possible victim based on the criteria with their contribution to society. We put a premium on lives that will save other lives, like doctors and nurses. Hmm. I feel like you should just swerve to the tree rather than hitting someone else. But I'm drinking the best sugar-free root beer. Ooh, tasty. I'm in pain and in such an awful position. Oh no, I'm gonna colonize the shit out of Mars just you watch. <laughs> okay, you can try, Raven. <laughs> just sitting weird. Sit normally. <laughs> you can do it, we believe in you. Yeah, go ahead, Raven, go try. <laughs> this one is a mixed bag, I feel. I feel like you can't determine the value of a life based on those things. Oh, this may sound- Yeah, because like, what if your robot turns out to be homophobic? <laughs> or sexist. <laughs> I'll be your number one supporter, Raven. I'll always stroke your ego. Oh my goodness. I may sound very reasonable, but Felix Gamble, head of- Oh, that's such a cool name. Head of Anti-Automation League, AAL, says the system has no right to make such judgments. Somebody with a criminal record is not necessarily less valuable to society than a doctor. That kind of information is irrelevant to the sanctity of human life. For once, I will agree with the anti stuff. You know what, my You're not invited if I colonize Mars. Okay, I'll go down with the ship. That's fine. <laughs> I wish you luck, though. But Forlong dismisses its claims. We want our cars to make the best choice, best possible choices, and that means acting on the basis of all information they can gather. The more, the better. Yeah, I feel like that was a reasonable thing that I actually agree with the people on. Just because someone's been to jail doesn't mean they're any less than a doctor. It's been to you're always invited, I think. Everyone except me is invited to Mars because I don't believe. Also, B or B are still here but can't type. Okay. Which on? And now to sports. First up, basketball. As the Gears prepare for the critical match with Denver tonight at the Cyclops Arena in Detroit, league negotiations are still ongoing over the possibility of allowing one Android player per squad. Debate rages as to whether the change would lead to more exciting matches or be the first step in making human players obsolete. Cyberlife has announced its willingness to participate I'll also be your beef here, by here more time. <laughs> specialized model to every team. Now, androids are already used to train players and provide tactical advice for coaches since 2035. 
but no Android player has been <laughs> permitted to compete so far. Oh, this is cute. Disney movie. <laughs> Five thousand jobs were lost from the U.S. economy in October, according to the Department of Labor, bringing the unemployment figure up to thirty-seven point three. Why did it cut like that? Finally, I can watch a damn hockey game in peace without prod bitching in my ear. spoke today at the opening of a new cyber life plant near <laughs> Milwaukee. At the event, the president again praised cyber How to tame your dragon. <laughs> performance of the U.S. economy. She further announced that the Department of Defense will acquire 200,000 Android combat units as part of her increased military spending. Yeah, that's a good decision, Kara. And I not like I have a Boston cream honey bun. Ooh, tasty. What a slop for real. Ventilate room. What's bro doing in here? I wish I could open my windows though. My cats will get out if I do. I don't have any screen on my windows. What's going on with my mic? What the hell? That southern was calling me a slob for the honey bun. Like, fine, you don't get any. <laughs> my my sound bar for my mic was bouncing. Antidepressant. Okay. Nothing really. Did you wash your hands, bitch? Cleaning, yeah, and a discussion about sports. Oh wait, no, you didn't miss the sports. Okay, what are all my missions? I cleaned restroom. What's the difference between a restroom and a bathroom? Thank God they cut away. Yeah, for real. Is the restroom what you just call one with a toilet? Strangle him, Kara. Strangle him. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> it's like that. It's like that meme. 
Why do they call it a restroom? I'm fighting for my life in here. <laughs> Good lord, this is the maid simulator. <laughs> Mop sucks. Ain't no way she got that shit clean with one swipe. <laughs> no knocks. Just coming in. I just want to tidy up your room a little. I only need two minutes. Is that okay, Alice? And there's like timer in the corner. Two minutes started. <laughs> Seems you like reading. Seems like you're a little nosy, Kara. One of those things you'd use on your car windshield. <laughs> yeah, a squeegee. Alice in Wonderland. Alice in Wonderland. I love Alice in Wonderland so much. Of course. I was thinking about uh, having like a Cheshire themed outfit. Her room seems clean already. Uh, compared to Todd's, it is, yeah. It's me and Alice playing, don't worry about it. She's got a doll of me, she's my Toriku fan. Oh, I already looked at Alice from the new one. For heavy duty messes in the bathroom, heavy duty mop required. <laughs> Maybe do that for Halloween? Ooh, that's right, yeah. I, I wasn't thinking of a Halloween costume for this year. Yeah, by the way, for my birthday, I will have a new outfit reveal, hopefully. Why is Alice so scared of Kara? She is not scared of her. It's she saw Kara get broken two weeks ago. So she's kind of like traumatized a little bit. And Kara doesn't remember her. So she's like, eh. she's 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 shy and being sad. Mm, friendly. I'm sure we used to be friends before I was reset. Maybe we can be friends again. You should tell me about yourself. Oh, just drink at home. What you like to do, yeah, where you like to go, your favorite yeah. foods. That I wish really I could stream me. on Halloween. Your father said you chose my name. Kara, it's nice. <laughs> But, um, How did you choose it? We have a holiday, so I can't. What about your mother? I can't stream on. Will she be home soon? Halloween. Sorry. I'm sorry, Alice. <gasps> what I get? Token of trust. Akita, your heart. Dog, dog. Probably we don't want to class sleep for some other reason. Yeah, I've done that. One year I went as Toga. I was scared because like imagine seeing your caregiver get beaten to death and then come back two weeks later. Probably poop my pants too. Yeah, for real. Oh, what a lovely family. get a reason why we named her Kara? Or 
or why she was named Kara? Is it because of her mom? I think if we take um, Chibitsu, um, Chibitsu uh, trick or treating, then I might dress up. Cause I kind of wanted to last year, but I didn't. I don't think it's ever explained. Oh. Oh, this is the end of the hall. Whoops. I finished cleaning your filthy house, bitch. What are you doing? I'm playing. You're playing. I know what you're thinking. Oh, you call little baby? Yeah, TV too. Think your dad's a low life, huh? Fucking loser. Can't get a job. Take care of his family. Don't you think I tried to make things work? I wish I had a better name for my brother-in-law. Well, whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up. I know what you think of me. You hate me. You hate me, don't you? Say it! Leave my daughter alone. I do. I hate you, bitch. Bobby Mims says, you. thank you. What am I doing? I don't talk about him much on stream, but yeah, that's what I call him. I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're grinding your jaw like you that. You know I love you, don't you? You know I love you. Oh, she got the eyebrow. She was like, oh, I know something's not right here. Well, I'm the man that doesn't knock on doors. The door opener. I missed two things. How the hell do I miss two things? Hmm, you'll find out why the spot is that way at the end of the game and it's sad. I think I kind of remember. I don't remember all the specifics, but I kind of do. And it's so hard not to make too many jokes. About, not, not about that, but about... Jokes and references about a certain other thing. Oh, Welcome home, Marcus. <laughs> Man, with many keys. Despite everything, it's still you. Can I look at the bird? Bird activated to kill. My house would grip me like that, although my luck it would malfunction and <laughs> say welcome home shithead. <laughs> welcome home, fucker. <laughs> Prepare to be eliminated. Android bird, yeah. Can I look at stuff before? It painted me. I feel like I should have done this last. Now I can't go interact with anything. Oh, yes, I can. Never mind. What are those? Chocolate Stra covered strawberries or raspberries? I 
I love his house so much. Hmm. North Pole, why Russia wants it? Bonus culture, why bankers pay themselves so much? Is President Warren too close to cyber life? I don't understand houses that have dining, kitchen, and living room all separated. Yeah. Well, nice giraffe. Yeah, for real. Russia's interest in the North Pole has intensified with the recent discovery of many precious minerals trapped in the frozen ice, many of which are used in synthesizing Ethereum. Marcus, you good there? Bro glitched for a second. Android manufacturer manufacture increasingly dominates both the U.S. and Russian economies. This isn't about GDP surplus. Ethereum reserves would allow either nation to experiment in more advanced Android models, enhancing their military and industrial output tremendously. Add this to the strategic importance of the region, with connect which connects Russia with Europe through Norway and Denmark, Greenland. Wait, why are those two marked as the same thing? And a clause with, like, a word with Russia. <laughs> And the prospect of peaceful resolution to the dispute starts to seem unlikely. But a spokesperson for NATO is more optimistic. Both nations stand to benefit from a stable, productive Ar Arctic region. The conflict would ben benefit nobody. Hold on, someone messaged me. Oh. I'll be right back. Kids and mama's going to bed. I'm gonna go say goodnight really quick.
sorry, chat. <clears throat> I'm gonna grab some water real quick. Oh no! <laughs> President War, however, recently he torpedoed the notion it's simple. Russia has no business in the Arctic. If the Kremlin doesn't understand that, we will make them understand. Oh my god. Welcome back. Thank you. Oh. Detroit today. What I found on Titan. Evidence for alien life grows. President Warren's make state visit to the United Kingdom. NATO Security Council divided over Arctic dispute. I don't feel like reading the rest of that. Checkmate in three moves for silver. Cool. I don't, I don't play that, so I don't know how chess works. <laughs> okay, it's only because I ran to get back in here. Are you afraid the drift would fall on me? Yeah. It's probably like bolted to the floor or something. I'm supposed to be in here yet because I do know that I'm glad I come in here later. Oh, it's two-legged mermaid. That's fun. There's stairs? Yeah. I know, sure. Oh, I'm so glad I can get a closer look at the giraffe thing. What's up, old man? Oh. Good morning, Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. The weather is partly cloudy, 54 degrees. 80% humidity with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. I did go to pick up the paint that you ordered. Oh, yes, I've forgotten. That would be that somebody who's a character lead over the rail and started talking to the truck. <laughs> you never forget anything. Is there anything that looks... Oh, what the fuck is that thing up there? Cat face possum! Kiddo got out of the box while the baby kitten was still attached and made the baby go with. <laughs> I really wish I could have one of those kittens. They're so cute. Show me your arm, please, Carl. No. Carl. Thank you. Hmm. I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. You're so sweet to each other. 
Humans are such a fragile machine. I love Carl. I wish dads were real. They break down so quickly. All this effort to keep them going. Hey, what happened to your clothes? Oh, it's nothing. Just some demonstrators in the street, Carl. What a bunch of idiots. They think they can stop progress by roughing up a few androids? I hope they didn't harm you. Oh, no, no. They just pushed me around, Carl. I'm fine. Okay. I'll take you to the bathroom now. Have you agree, Carl? You're on to something? Yeah. What if I dropped him? <laughs> no, my no. Shit. I'm not going to, but I just had it in. I just had to voice that impulsive thought. Oh, he's got a barn owl statue. Alright, Carl. Anything special on the Ooh. agenda today? Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art. Mm -hmm. The gallery director left four messages asking to confirm your attendance. Hmm. I haven't decided yet. We'll see about that later. Okay. What else? Just your usual fan mail. I've already answered. Hmm. Thank God I got cut away from another bathroom Any scene. <laughs> got you on my no, fancy Carl. headset and PC. I was I can trying. Call him if you like. No. Trying myself into a pretzel, trying no, to lean bother. over to type on my laptop. <laughs> We're getting a lot of shots of Marcus's butt. I'm starving. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, I'm just sorry, the way Carl. you are. Thank you, Marcus. You're welcome. He really wanted to push you into that. I said he's got an entire bakery back there for real. This is faster than actual chairs. Television. Yeah. Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? Sure. Hmm? Okay, Carl. Little smile. He's so cute. All right, guys, what, what should we do? <clears throat> Rick Carl, set the parking brake and you are ready to go. <laughs> Marcus. But he's stuck getting stuck. Play chess? We're not doing it in that because I can't play this. I can't play chess. Can we give Carl some music? Oh, can I not go in there? Wait, I should be able to go in there. Or read something. Give him some music? Okay. each one of these.
<laughs> I just have to button mash. You know, this sounds oddly familiar. Yeah, I can't remember what song it is. That's how fast I'm mashing the button, by the way. Thank you, Carl. Something has changed in the way you I play. played it from my heart. Just Sometimes for you. Sometimes I think you have more humanity than most humans. Exactly. One day I won't be here to take care of you anymore. I'm going to fall You'll off at this point. Yeah, my wrist hurts really bad. You make your choices. Decide who you are. You know how you, you can feel calm. the two bones in your arm? I can feel them right now. This world heart. doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Let's go to the studio. I'm trying to be the passionate, creative person that Carl wants me to be. Let's see where we left off. Remove the sheet. Would be so cool, yeah. clean a studio. But I wish I had a studio. I love to paint so much. I hate painting digitally because it's so difficult for me, but I love, love, love acrylic painting. If I had more space and could afford to do acrylic painting, I so would. This is new to paint me. You're in a wheelchair, Carl. Carl, watch this. <laughs> so, what's your verdict, Marcus? Mm, I like it. Yes, there is something about it. Mm. Something I can't quite define. I guess I like it. The truth is, I have nothing left to say anymore. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. You don't have to say something uh, to make art. But enough about me. Let's see if you have any talent. Give it a try. Try painting something. Paint? What would I... Painting what? Anything you want. 
Give it a try. I like that thing would malfunction. I'd be stuck up there all day. <laughs> Me too. I was just thinking about that. Just imagining him like just dangling there with his feet, just like swaying because he's stuck up there. Find a subject. Paint statue, paint death. Don't recreate what he wanted. Alright guys, what should we do? Should we paint the statue, paint the desk, or repaint Carl's painting? Carl? That's a tough one. Yeah, Carl, okay. Maybe Marcus will add something. What direction is that? That is a perfect copy of reality. The painting is not about replicating the world. It's about interpreting, improving on it. He probably would have said that Showing no matter something you see. what I did. Carl, I don't th think I can do that. It's not in my program. I... Go on, go, try it. Grab that canvas. Yeah, but sass and mannerisms of sass are programmed into your thing. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Trust me. Try to imagine something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. I do that every day. Now concentrate on how it makes you feel and let your hand drift across the canvas. Doing this? Hmm, Android's humanity or identity? I'm thinking maybe identity. What are you guys feeling? Identity? Identity? Okay. Android's despair, doubts are prisoner. Doubts, maybe? Despair. Doubt. Alright, Southern, what are you feeling? Doubts? Okay, we're going doubts. Yeah, I know why you want despair, Vindy. By the way, um, if any like the people that do art in here, you should try this. You should just try to like either close your eyes or don't think about what you're painting because it's so fun. <laughs> oh my god. Hey dad. Leo. I didn't hear you come in. No, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. You guys do this thing when we draw it's five while, minutes right? and swap papers? Yes! You all right? <laughs> you don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, 
I need some cash, Dad. Again? What happened to the money I just gave you? Uh, well, it just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No. No, no, I swear, it's not that. No, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash, that's all. You know, if you Sorry. invested it. The answer is no. What? Why? You know why. I'm protecting Carl yeah, with my fucking yeah, life, by the way. I don't care <laughs> what rather, I have to do to this bitch. You'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's, what's he got that I don't? Smarter? More obedient? Not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine! Leo, that's enough! Enough. If I don't fight back, Carl gets hurt, right? Raven? You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. Raven? You've never <laughs> loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. You Raven never loved me. You suck, Leo. You have a real... Like, yeah, Carl might have been, like, a bad dad in the past, but, like, you can't... Think so? Okay. I will throw hands with him, don't worry. I think if you do fight, he has like a heart attack or something, we need to do some research. Please! I don't want anything to happen to Carl. <laughs> That either way you go, yeah. Yeah, I knew it. All of those had the same outcome. I like that they show the outcome potentials. <clears throat> Cause it, it like reassures me. Next time, next time we do this, I'll do despair because I will probably have multiple playthroughs. No, what's the redacted Southern? What's the redacted? If you fight Leo, Leo falls and hits his head. But if you don't fight, then he has a heart attack. That's fine. I'll fight. Yeah, I'll fight Leo. Heads can be fixed. Hearts, not so much. You, well, let me let me put it this way: <clears throat> young heads can be fixed better than old hearts. Okay, <laughs> old hearts that are already about to give out. <laughs> Flying Lieutenant Anderson. Shit, I I weren't allowed here. Can I scan your face? Excuse me. Sire. Allow me to scan your face. <laughs> Myers Derek. Security guard. Criminal record? None. Good for him. At the end of the bar, third guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know, I know. But I'm trying to just get everything before I do that. Got possible trigger warning. It depends on the path you take. Oh no. Ray Christopher, unemployed, criminal record DUI. Ooh, you're the worst. What's your problem? Fucking stupid ass DUIs. Why would you do that? Don't drink and drive. Was someone self exiting? Oh no, tell me who. Like, in DMs. Dempsey Edward, administrator. Find a drink? Maybe. DUI in a bar? Yeah. I think if you have a DUI on your record, that should be put on your license and you shouldn't be allowed to drink anymore. Like, at least at bars. Graham Jonah, unemployed, criminal record none. Good for him. Can I scan your face? 
か I know who it is. I'm just trying to avoid it. A, you won't get to it during this episode. B, I don't think your choices will lead to that. Okay. What? Oh, no, never mind. You're the worst one in this bar. Delivery driver currently unemployed. Criminal record domestic abuse. Johan Kim. You suck. Breathalyzer installed in the car in most states. That should be Yeah. McCray Samuel. Cool, good for you. I'm trying to make sure you aren't Mr. Amber. Ward Dennis, accountant, currently unemployed. Bro. You're not- you're not worse than Mr. Kim over there, but you're still pretty bad. Robert Chris, unemployed not. Good for you. This is self exit on Discord? Okay. In everyone's face? Yeah, I'm nosy. <clears throat> Hello, I'm doing good, how are you? Oh, it's... I might just go the full extra 30 minutes. Kyoshi, I was not calling you. Oh! Oh yeah, I remember that. Yeah, I don't think... I don't think anything I do will lead to that. But if I start going on that path... Please, please, please be like, hey... My, uh, warning. <laughs> Glad to hear it, I'm fine. That's good, that's good. What a handsome fella! Wait, can I go back in there further? I'm nosy. Is that a 37? It makes me very curious to see what the unemployment rate is now. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you, Raven. You can tell it might happen. Not happen? Yeah, I appreciate it. Okay, Mr. Oh, can I scan the bartender? This is owner! Lieutenant Hank Anderson, please, Lieutenant. Lieutenant Anderson. I'm gonna get the dad ending. I'm the android sent by Soccer Life. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyber Life android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized... So, I'm gonna to try to do anything that I can well, I to get on his good assistance. side. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. Just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. Uh, reason with him. Listen, I think you should stop drinking and come with me. It'll make life easier for both of us. I don't think that was the right answer. Understand. I understand that some people are not comfortable in the presence of androids, but I, I am perfectly comfortable. Now back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. Gonna threaten? Well, I'll buy you another drink. You know what? I'll buy you one for the road. What do you say? Bartender, the same again, please. See, that gym yeah. wonders of technology. Make it a double. Yeah. He likes when I feel his alcoholism. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Did you say homicide? 
<laughs> anyway, I just came to say hi. I gotta get some sleep. So yeah, have fun and take care. Uh, sleep. Oh, sorry. Controller rumbling. Have some good sleep. Thank you for stopping in. I appreciate it. For example, don't freaking drive, kids. Always have a designated driver. Yeah, he should have let Connor drive. You wait here. I won't be long. Uh, My instructions are to accompany you to the crime whoops. scene, Lieutenant. Listen, I don't give a fuck about your instructions. Did it go I down? Told you to wait I wasn't here. paying attention. Sorry. So you shut the fuck up and you wait here. Looks like the order selecting priority. <laughs> no, let me behave. You're taking a long Josh leg Douglas express. I drink as much as Hank. Yeah, for real. I'm not confirming anything. Yeah, if I was Hank just then, I'd be like, I can confirm that it, I can confirm that it's a case of Nanya. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me. What part of stay in the car didn't you understand? Your order contradicted my instructions, Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out I'm of my way. I'm gonna lick it. Got it? Got it. Even at Hank, Ooh, we people were starting to think you weren't gonna show. <laughs> yeah, that was the plan till this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. We had a call around eight from the landlord. The tenant had to pay his rent for a few months. So he thought he oh, yeah, he sure is. Thread coat over there. There is a dead body ahead. It will be gross. If this makes you uncomfortable, please look away, ma'am. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Stayed inside most of the time. They hardly ever saw him. Wow, well, stayed he's in. Wasn't worth calling everybody out. Very gross. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's, it's very gross, night. and I have to get very Just close to it. Till morning. I'd say he's been there for a good three weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Probably the murder weapon. Poor guy. Any sign of a break in? Oh, this episode of CSI, nope. Andrew. The landlord <laughs> said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. Like an what do we know about his yeah. Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. I, I gotta get some air. Make yourself at home. I'll be outside if you need me. You know what I said? They said he's a loner. Each letter is perfect. It's way too neat. No human rights. That's like why this. they were um, waiting to Chris, assess it. Chris, is this written in the victim's blood? I would say so. We're taking samples for. I'm analysis. trying to. But it's also a bunch of stab wounds. It's not. It doesn't look like a like an unalive self destruct. Yeah. Ortiz Carlos, theft and aggravated assault. Hmm. Knife wound. Twenty eight stab wounds. Oh, internal bleeding. Twenty eight stab wounds. Deceased more than nineteen days ago. You were slide. Yeah. It's jaundice. Hmm. I stayed at her death at 11.30 p.m. 5.6. Oh, she was short king. Red ice. That's the thing that Mr. Man had. Not his sandals. I think it's John. I think that's the definition of that is, is the <laughs> <Eight times. laughs> 
Yeah. Seems like the killer really had it in for him. He's like, why are you laughing about that? I'm alive, how do you get it see-through? Regular letters, font, fiber, splice, stand. Lick in the blood! Oh, Jesus, what the hell are you doing? I'm analyzing the blood. I can check samples in real time. I'm sorry. I should have warned you. Okay, just don't put any more evidence in your mouth, you got it? Got it. Is a little finger <sighs> oh, Fucking hell, I can't believe this shit. I think you're gonna be very happy about that. <laughs> Dried blood. Mr. Old Key. Red ice. Seems our friend Carlos liked to party. Chris, I want full analysis on the narcotics. Consider it done, Lieutenant. Did he use a stencil to get those letters on? Those are so uniform. <laughs> He's a robot. Not the tomato juice! Hey, Mike, you finished taking samples there? Fingerprints, Android involvement. Yeah, that's it. Oh my god, the robot lesbians! I forgot about them. What I have to do is be like human, but not human enough to get me decommissioned. Do you think give Android some form of fingerprint? Yeah, like one that links back to their ID number or something. Make you claim the funniest person position around. <laughs> I think Suki would be so thrilled to hear you say that. It's a little sad that none of you are saying the VTuber you're watching is the funniest person around, but whatever. <laughs> You should have a stand up special. <laughs> Alright, Vinci, this is what we were talking about. No explicit stuff in chat, though. Sorry, it was sticky. <laughs> oh, yeah, my, you were very funny. Oh, that's so convincing. You have convinced me immediately. Suki claimed that, that like, a last draft shoot. Yeah. Get decommissioned by fucking up super bad, like making all the wrong choices, wrong in regards with what the commission doesn't agree with. Wait, does that mean be human? Or does that mean just failing and like getting destroyed a bunch? You are very funny, Maya. Thank you. Hmm. Well, we'll read. Um, Android did that. Do you a guide if you want? I kind of do. Mm, yeah, I'll skim over the guide for only his part because I there's a, I <laughs> I want I want I want the bond, you know. Android form is officially better. Sorry, ladies, plastic can't be beat. I'm gonna eventually make the commission so pissed off that you get decommissioned. Yeah. Is your android spying on you? CyberLife could be using his androids to collect private information. There's chemistry. Welcome back, Ami. Or welcome. Wait, were you here at all? Welcome, Ami. I 
I'm gonna go. Oh, I don't want to go 20 more minutes because I'm just be a fool. I'll finish this this sequence and then I'll end stream. Cyber life could be using his androids to collect private information. Zero gravity subway to connect NYC and DC in 45 minutes. I'm here now. Yeah, welcome, Ami. Is your android spying on you? Cyber life could be you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. More and more experts are suggesting that CyberLife uses its 120 million androids to record details of private conversations of its customers and tell them to trading partners. Even talked about, ever talked about buying that new car while eating dinner with your partner? CyberLife could use that information for targeted advertising. The information goldmine doesn't stop there. Everything from personal indiscretions to political affiliation could be easily extracted and potentially used for nefarious purposes. This is going to be a bit of a hot take, but I personally do not care if the government is spying on me through my phone. What the fuck are they going to find out? That I like anime boys? Okay. The entire, the entire internet knows I like anim anime boys. What is the government going to do about it? The spate of reports linking Warren's presidency to CyberLife only deepens such concerns. Several consumer rights and or rights organizations have requested that. Thank you for the follow. Thank you. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for getting lost in the woods. Honestly, Sam, yeah. What's got anyone trying to tap into my phone? Yeah, they would see like, me talking about Sample Koski, and then they'd be like, okay, we're not spy. Buying on that one. In stream soon? I will, I promise. <laughs> it's just I started late. I'm late behind on it, yeah. Then you had to protect Connor, thank you. Oh, I guess we can't read how the uh how the game has changed. No one wants to stay here a minute longer than they have to. Oh, yes, yes. Request six. Don't worry. Did you take a look? Not yet, sir. Thanks for asking. I know you weren't asking me. Is there nothing else I can look at? Oh, there's no mirror. Living over all about the movie. Obsessive writing. RA9. RA9. Oh, wait. Is it RA9? I think it's RA9. 28 stab wounds. Yeah. <laughs> oh, can I not go up there yet? Up there, by the way? Yeah. One more piece of evidence to find? Yeah, I don't know where it is. Oh, this dude had a fucking door connecting his house? That's so cool. Oh, is it this? Oh no, it's something over here. No? Bitch, I already read this! Go outside yet? Oh, I can go outside? Oh, it won't let me read it again. What, do I go out through this door? Oh. 
door was locked from the inside. Killer must have gone out this way. There are no footprints apart from Officer Collins' size 10 shoes. Well, this happened weeks ago. The tracks could have faded. No. This type of soil would retain a trace. Oh, but that's it? For a long really? Time. So I can basically do it anywhere I want except for that? Evidence 9 out of 10 did not, not count as evidence? So is the killer still in the house? Yeah. Also, guys, be careful about spoilers because Venti hasn't seen it yet. The chair bring it up to the attic. Oh wait, no, I have to finish reconstructing the scene. But I didn't reconstruct this, but I don't know. All right, I'm out of here. Thanks for the ride. Great party. Wait! Wait, Lieutenant. I can't stay if you leave. As much as it breaks my heart, this is where we part what? ways. I just need five minutes to finish my investigation. Please, Lieutenant. Remember the drink I bought you at the bar? Just five minutes. Five minutes. Thank you, Lieutenant. I've never seen this before. Am I taking too long? I'm sorry, Lieutenant. I'm stupid. I just need to reconstruct. But how? In the living room, yeah, but I've already, I've already reconstructed this. Oh my god, it has a legit fucking timer up there. Yeah. How to reconstruct the murder in For real. Okay, I've already examined that. It was 16 likes? Yeah! I can't believe it's timing me. That's so stupid. Hold on, guys. Okay, so the blood... Yes, the other blood. The victim, the writing, okay. Yeah, I am. Okay, they're reconstructing it. He 
Yeah, but mine wasn't popping up for some reason, so I have to I have to find the specific place that I did that at. Oh my god, this person's not moving the fucking camera. It's the blind leading the motherfucking blind. This is, this is, okay, I was about to say this video is seriously irritating me because the game is telling them to move the camera and they're not moving the fucking camera. <laughs> That sure is helpful, my guy. Not. Okay, here we go. Ooh, this one even has like tells you what makes him happy. Review evidence. Analyze knife, analyze red eyes. Four marker in the living room, press L1 to look at it when prompted. I think I've already done that. Club flyer. Blood on walls, blood on walls. Backyard. Chair. Baseball ball. Near the nine marker on the kitchen floor near the refrigerator. Oh, I see you're playing my favorite game. Yes! Doing a bad job at it, but yes, I'm trying to at least. Why is it not letting me go? Hello? What the fuck? Have a hundred percent the game, amazing game. Yeah, I'm playing it technically for the first time, but not really for the first time. Why is my controller doing this? Not the controller difficulties again. No, I don't want to play with the mouse. I want to play with my controller. If I see my sister or brother-in-law that they're playing their game one more time, I'm going to lose my mind. Yes. Controller must be haunted. Yeah, for real. Why is up with it in timed games? Excuse me. Um, bitch, I know your batteries aren't dead. I just changed them yesterday. Did I not change one of the batteries properly? Adorable thumbnail, thank you.
Hold on, guys. I gotta test each one of these batteries. I fucking guess. I don't want to stream so late. Come on. Oh my god, it's taking issue with the top battery. Okay, so this battery is no good. Oh, what the hell? What is going on? I mean, it wouldn't be one of my streams if it wasn't an extremely scuffed, now would it? Literally, what is happening? Okay, fucking Christ. God damn. After changing out every battery twice. <laughs> okay, so it wanted me to go find the baseball bat. Me? Where's the baseball bat? Aggravated assault, but the guy's fingerprints is on it. This is a stereo. Maybe it took a knife. There it is, yeah. Maybe it was attacked, emotional shock. I did it! Hank, I did it! I can't believe I'm the only person that I've ever seen get that fucking thing. Hey, I finished. I'm sorry I took so long. Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh, yeah? Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started... In the kitchen. In the kitchen. There are obvious signs of a struggle. The question is, what exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android. Um, with a bat. With the bat. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. Finally, I didn't even want to be here in the first place. Is it for real? Um, um. The android stabbed the victim. The android stabbed the victim. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to... The living room, where he died. The living room. Hmm. Which honestly deserve. Tried to get away from the android. All right, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim. 
the knife. With the knife? Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous. But it doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat and lost some therium. Lost some what? Therium. Android blood. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' bio components. My eye itches. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh. But I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. <laughs> you like me. Follow me, buddy. I already know where it is, but... Can I grab this? You can see it. No, actually, I said it was invisible to the eyes. Were you not listening? <laughs> yeah. I knew he wasn't there. I just wanted to be silly. That chair. I'm going to check something. Uh, I'm going to check something. <laughs> I always looks so scared him for real. He's like a little wet puppy. Okay, after we complete this, I will end stream. And then I'm working here for real. It looks like he's gonna put his pants like a confused puppy. Yeah. Why did this man just have a mannequin sitting up here? Spooky attic, yeah. Being all quiet as if the deviant can't fucking hear him. I mean, I can't very well do much else. Doesn't let me look around a whole lot. Did I just see the red light sensor go off? Just a big ass cockroach, yeah. Sir! Don't come at me like that! I was just defending myself. I know, buddy. He was gonna kill me. I know, buddy. I'm begging you. Don't tell him. What the fuck is going on up there? It's here, Lieutenant! Oh shit. Chris! Ben! Get your asses in here now! Come on! I'm so glad we're pausing this, because these next chapters are about to be so fucking stressful. I didn't 100% it, but you can't because if you don't reconstruct the crime scene, Hank takes both out. I just hate this part. I wish you could choose. Yeah, for real. My dad had a man named Punching Bob, but it was just his head and torso, no arms or legs. In my backyard, when it got dark, I'd get so freaked out because it looked in the window. Oh. All the points, yeah. Now we end. Mm. 
whenever I get the flow chart, it saves, right? Be a man outside and almost poop my pants every time. <laughs> But but it it saves at the flow chart, right? Yeah, that was the end of a mission. Okay. Let's see if my wife has anything to say for me before we leave. Do you have anything to say, wifey? Nope. Okay. Okay. Thank you, gamers, for watching today's stream, no matter how scuffed it became. Um, I do want to remind everyone before I end the stream to please subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Oh my god, I see we have three new subscribers. That's crazy! Um, but yeah, if you're watching and you're not subscribed, please just go ahead and subscribe because it helps a lot. Um, also like the stream because it, it does help a lot. And I'll I'll play the game like twice if more people subscribe because they like it. Yippee! Yeah. Thank you, my hero. Also, as always, happy Easter, everyone. Yeah, happy Easter, everyone. Oh, hold on, you see. So, I will not be streaming tomorrow because we're gonna welcome everyone, subscribe, and like the streamer else. Yeah, for real. <laughs> Let's forget happy Ramadan. Happy Ramadan. I think I'm pronouncing that right. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. But ha but yeah, happy happy that. I don't know much about it, but I hope I hope it's going well. <laughs> um <clears throat> but I will not be streaming tomorrow because um we're celebrating Kids and Mama's birthday early. Um I may possibly stream on Sunday. Um if I do It'll be Ace Attorney. If not, then I'll stream Ace Attorney on Monday. Enjoy your weekend, Maya. We'll catch you next weekend. Yeah. Well, not next weekend, but <laughs> next week if I don't get to stream before then. Happy birthday to your mother. Thank you. Happy days, everyone. Yeah, happy days. Happy holidays, everyone. I hope everyone has a good weekend if I don't get to see you. Um, thank you all so much for coming today. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed today's stream. Um, I'll take it soon. Good night, everyone. Bye bye. Bye bye. If you don't get get my distracted chat, yeah, for real. It ends up being Ace Attorney and not a talking stream. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You guys just can't come in here being chatty Cathy's. <laughs> okay. Okay. Bye, everyone.